Don't throw out the meat. No, don't throw out the meat if you have chickens. Don't throw out your meat because chickens love a meat and it is one of the cheapest ways to feed your birds. Look at this. You don't think chickens don't love meat? The proof is in the pudding. Look at this. Mr. Hilder, yes, had some taxidermy work to pick up at a local taxidermist and the fellow had some scrap meat. Well, Mr. Hilder grabbed that scrap meat right away because not only will the dogs eat the scrap, the scrap meat, but the chickens will eat the scrap meat. Yes, chickens are not, I'm sorry, they're not vegetarian. They're not vegan. They love their meat. They love their protein and they love red meat. Look at, look at these gals. I mean, they, they eat red meat like, like men. Yeah, they love it. So Starry really wanted to do, that's me, I really want to do a video about trying to find scrap meat for your chickens because really it is a frugal way to feed your chickens, to supplement because the protein really is good for your chickens and it does help egg production and, it, and it's just, it's good stuff. It really is good stuff. Uh, but where do you find meat? It's not like every day you can go out and you can kill yourself an elk, right? And you got scraps. So, a uh, number one, roadkill. We all know about roadkill. Wherever you go in the United States, there's roadkill. Now, some places you can pick up roadkill. Other places you can't pick up roadkill. But if you do pick up roadkill, you know, all you simply need to do is make sure that it is good and not rotted. You can watch Mr. Hilder's uh, video on how to tell roadkill is good because you don't want to be feeding your chickens rotted roadkill. So make sure the roadkill is uh, good. It's not spoiled. It's not rotted. Uh, the next option is go to your supermarket and talk to the meat man. The meat man, yes. Uh, some meat markets do uh, get rid of their scraps and they allow for people to take those. Sometimes they don't, but they will charge a small fee for you to purchase the scrap. There you go. The other place that you can go also, especially if you live in an area where there's hunting, a lot of hunters uh, will take their animals into uh, like meat markets where they process the animal, they skin the animal, they butcher the animal, uh, they package it up. And those places have a lot of extras like this. And what they do is they put them in pails and very often time they just offer it to the public for pickup for free because you know they can do that we have a, a place here in town a locker a meat locker where i can go pick up dog bones i can pick up scrap meat um you know all the stuff that they they you know they can't use and we feed it to our chickens and we feed it to our dogs for free the other thing is and this just goes back is if if you have a freezer check your freezer and don't throw out the frozen, uh, freeze-dried meat. You know, how many times do people clean out their freezers and they have freeze-dried meat that they're like, oh, well, this is bad. Well, it may be bad, but it's not bad enough for the chickens. The chickens will eat freeze-dried meat, just thaw it out and feed it to them. You don't have to cook it. Remember, chickens can eat raw meat. They're meat eaters. You don't have to cook anything. And again, uh, you are utilizing everything on your homestead to feed these birds for free, basically. All right, so this is just a starry tip. Chickens are meat eaters. Go, oh yeah, and, and they do like their vegetables. See how they supplement? <laughs> All right, God bless and go find yourself some meat for your chickens. And just remember, even baby chickens will eat the meat. See, peepers like meat too. It's good for them.